And here we have Bordeaux against Paris Saint-Germain. I'm Peter Drury, and here with me in the commentary box, I'm glad to report, is Jim Beglin. Thanks, Peter. Hello, everybody. I'm ready to see what unfolds in this one now. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Marco Verratti. He's got great vision and passing ability and seems to be able to dictate the play in midfield. He also tends to develop a really good understanding with the forwards and just kind of senses the runs that they'll make. And I'm intrigued to see how he performs today. Yeah, I'd have picked him too. No doubt the fans feel much the same way. Traxler. Florenzi tries to get it forward quickly. Looks like a good ball through. Quick thinking by the keeper, he did well. Truthfully, it was hard to see any better outcome there. Florenzi. Neither side yet able to find the net. Paredes. And it's Neymar. Oh, that's neat. Good clearance and very necessary. Looks to slip it through. He's made sure that that won't get through. Draxler. Verratti. Icardi. You can get that clear. Marquinhos. Still waiting for the first goal. Marco Verratti. De Trevi. And it's Pardo. Pardo. Plays it out to the flank. Who's going to make this theirs? And the first half is done. Some first half thoughts. Well, they've never really been threatened in the first half. I think it's been a magnificent team effort. The work rate has been superb. Very, very organised. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil-nil. Well, that first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we'd hoped. Lots of effort, but a, a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone can step up and produce... He has seen that as a dive. Well, that's just very cynical. For him to think he could get away with it is uh, is ugly on his part. Paredes. Kira. Out to the left it goes. A chance! Neymar crosses in a low one. And that really should have hit the net. Right in front of the goal like that, and he's gone and missed it. I won't have to tell him that's not good enough. This defence just doesn't trust itself to, to play a higher line. Frighten the people getting in behind. Yeah, absolutely. It just opens up the opportunity of not only strikers getting behind, but the runners from midfield too. Keira did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Trexler. And Icardi! It's come loose. Boots it to safety. It's a loose ball. Corner.
a swing at it! Oh, that is very close. Yeah, and he knew he had to get his efforts away before it had been closed down, but he could have sacrificed a little power then for a bit more accuracy. Tries a through ball. Now the pass. Keeper's ball. And it's Neymar. Has it out wide now. Mauro Icardi! Aimed long and direct. Pardo. Keino Navas catches it safely. Di Maria. Uh, it's been intercepted and that will come to nothing. Spoon forward. Keira does well there. Alert. Back to the keeper and try something new. Neymar is pulsing down that left-hand side and that's been repelled into a minimum of four minutes additional time that'll be a throw-in checks on the touchline a change about to occur Pablo pumps it upfield. And it time is up. And there goes the whistle. And stalemate. One, if not for fans, then perhaps for coaches. Satisfied by organisation and solidity. Little cutting edge at either end. And it finishes nil-nil.